Okay, so this one, Fierce Pork Trooper number one. All right, so equipment. Um, by the way, I got everybody down to one HP besides Salsa. Or no, everyone is actually knocked out besides Salsa. So um, I got to equip everything he had once again uh, to maximize his damage output. And as for items, he has all hot spring eggs. I just filled him up on these. And I gave him the last pencil rocket bone he had from the end of chapter four. This is the last one I got there. So if I want any more, I have to go to that pig mask later on the highway. Now this, this, um, this boss is actually much more straightforward than the more recent ones have been. It's pretty much just have Salsa attack uh, by using Monkey Mimic and then healing. Try to get as many attacks in before you have to heal, so on and so forth. Now, there is a much easier way to do this, which is to have Salsa just use D some DCMC merch to uh, mesmerize him and then spam pencil rockets. I'm going to try to not do it this way. For one thing, I don't have enough pencil rockets to even really justify mesmerizing him that long because what can I really do? So, just going to just going to try, and if things get too frustrating, I will just give it a shot with the DCMC merch. But let's try. So this is my first attempt. I just had to do it this way so that we could get things to work properly, so that it can just start out with salsa. So just had to kill myself. So, let's do this. Best song of the game. All right, cool. Okay, we're gonna try to get two in. And hot spring egg. So, unequipped everything, and I also moved it to, okay. I also moved it to Duster or Bony, one of them. I moved it to one of their, uh, whatever you wanna call it. Well, what's it called? Uh, their dang inventories. Because I wanted to... Alright, so here's one thing. Salsa will retaliate the total amount of damage he took, and not just... I should have gone for another attack there, but whatever. Let's just speed that up. I've also moved it to Salsa, or uh, to one of another person's inventory in order to... Oh, that's not good. That's really not good. Let's fire the pencil rocket, I guess. Dang it. Well, I think that's already kind of screwed us over. Yep. Dang, we're having such a good beginning, too. Anyways, as I was mixing things up repeatedly while I was trying to say, I moved to someone else's inventory just so Salsa could have maximum inventory space for... Oop, come on, don't. Okay, cool. Uh, just so that Salsa could have maximum space in his inventory for hot spring eggs. Let's just let this scroll up first. Now, if you can just get him to kind of keep wailing on you, this is one of the easier bosses in this entire run, actually. No! Did it again! Oh, man. Oh, that sucks. Right, right off the bat, too. It just means Salsa can't do anything, so, like, it is kind of an instant lose, unfortunately. He usually doesn't do it this much. Oof. Let's just let that scroll up first. Okay, wasted his turn. So, yeah, the method with this one is just to kind of keep retaliating with Monkey Mimic. Hopefully, he just doesn't knock us unconscious of using special moves, really. Come on. It's kind of a dangerous battle just because he has some attacks that just last much longer than others. Like when he starts punching away at you. Okay. Alright. Stop doing that, man. See, every time he's taking the powerful swings is when I'm... No! Oh, dang! We made it so far, too, and now we're just, we're done, because there's no way we're gonna be able to beat him before we... Ugh, oh, man, that sucks. We were so close, too. I feel like we got pretty far that time. Alright, mixed up my RNG before the battle once again. That 
bad. Oh, he even retaliated more than usual. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Cool. See, this is what we want, really. I still can't believe that last time I survived accidentally using, uh, what did I accidentally use? The pencil rocket instead. Okay. Yeah, we just kind of wanted to keep taking these powerful swings. Not that way. Let's see, I'm just gonna keep going for a while and see if I can... And, and see if Salsa will eventually remember how to do it, because I'm just not sure how long that... I'm not sure if it just lasts the whole battle and you have to heal it. Because that would be very unfortunate, but... If that's the case, that just sucks. Oh! Yes, good. That's what we needed. That's what I thought. Cool. Please don't heal. Ah, he keeps healing. Okay, there. So maybe the last, unfortunately, maybe the last uh, one just wasn't as much of a lost cause as I was ex as I was thinking it was. Maybe I could have still beat him. Oh well, it's not that bad. This is it's as as it, it it's still difficult, but it's still pretty simple for the most part because it's really just a monkey mimic heal. Okay. At least we're getting something. It sucks when he uses that move, though, because he... Don't... Okay. I thought he was healing again. It just sucks when he uses that move because it really just doesn't put out the level of damage we're looking to. Okay, can you use these moves when I'm... When I'm using Monkey Mimic, please. Come on. Good. Yes, we like to see that. No! I'm gonna let this scroll up. Alright, cool. Not one of his more dangerous moves, especially not in this situation. Alright. I feel like we're pretty close. Luckily, it doesn't appear that he'll ever do it twice in a row, the healing, so if I can just... Oop. Okay, cool. Oh, great. Ah, man. We've been hitting the gym, haven't we? Goodness. Okay. Yes! There we go. Not not too bad. That took me like 10, 10 minutes to do, roughly. So not not really that bad. And now Salsa's level se uh, 17. And we get a pickle veggie plate, all for Salsa. Ignore that it's Lucas picking it up. All right, now that we've had our brush with fairness in this, it's time to get back to the dumb RNG. <laughs> Forlorn Jump Keep is going to be... Let's not do that yet. I wanted to show you this <laughs> <laughs> Forlorn Junkie. So, Salsa, uh, you need 10 Super Bombs to win. That's a guaranteed win. Now, if this thing never heals itself, you only need 7, but that's very unlikely, and it can heal for 300 HP each time. So, basically, Monkey Mimic is not the way to go here. Uh, now, I got... Salsa, the Fly Charm, Sparrow Bandana, and Taurus Bracelet, which you can get from the Hot Dog Man, and the Vending Machine before the Clay Man Factory. Whew. This is going to be a tough one, because this one has a lot more RNG than I'm even used to, because if if he makes Salsa nauseated, it's over. Um, we gotta just, we have to be pretty lucky and get 10 Super Bomb hits, but just with this extra defense these things give him, he'll be able to survive more hits than usual. Okay, let's do this. 
Salsa, Salsa will come down when he's ready. Okay. Defend. Let's just do a couple of these. Super bombs. These are these are our key to victory here. So there's one off. Cheerfully through scrap metal. Okay. And unfortunately, the cutscene does revive everybody except. Uh, well, yeah, it revives everyone to one HP. There's two. No. No. immediately so basically when you're nauseated that means you cannot eat any of the hot spring eggs which are kind of my key to victory so unless this thing doesn't hit me twice <laughs> in the next one two three four five six and so optimally if this thing goes five turns without hitting me or healing me i'll or healing itself i'll win if not it's over. This thing's kind of already over, but I'm just gonna try for the hell of it. All right, well, it didn't heal itself, I guess. Or I guess it, it didn't hit me, that's what it didn't do. Okay. I can't believe it happened on the on like the third turn. That sucks, man. No way. No way. One one try? That was insanely lucky. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, I just want to make it clear that that's insanely lucky that happened and I I probably should not have gotten away with that. Okay. Um, on to the next boss, I guess. <laughs> Salsa's so strong, he didn't even have to come down. Okay, so I would show you everyone's stats, but, um, yeah, that, that happens when you have five party members, so we're just gonna skip that. So, basically, let's just look at the stat. Nope. <laughs> let's look at the stats really quick. Again, everyone at one HP except Salsa. Phony's not really in the battle, so it doesn't matter. And, uh, oh shoot, he's nauseated. Okay, went back to the beginning of the dungeon to buy a freshman for our beloved Salsa. There you go. Salsa's inventory looking a little different. <laughs> all hot spring eggs because, once again, we are, we've removed all of our armor to maximize damage output, and this time it's actually less, less difficult to beat the Fierce Port Trooper this way. Now, again, you could just spam super bombs after using DCM, DCMC pamphlet or whatever, but I wanted to go for the more challenging route So we are going to be doing it this way. It's not optimal, but it's very possible And it's actually much more possible also because the fear sport trooper now will fly into a, fur a fury and instead of healing itself actually gets stronger So let's do it Okay Okay. Let's, um, let's see here. I guess we'll just have Salsa Guard. Get these freaking idiots out of the way. Get out of here, you freaking idiots. No! Ow! Oh, not him. Not... Not Salsa. Come on, hit. Yes, there we go. All right. And it's important to keep those, keep those eggs, those hot spring eggs as close to the beginning of your, goodness, as close to the top of your inventory as possible so that you can just mash A when you get to Salsa's turn on the item menu so you don't have to think about it.
Disappointing. Again, disappointing. Goodness. Okay, there we go. And you can reorganize your inventory, actually, uh, by simply... What's that do? I think that just lowers our offense. You can actually reshuffle your inventory simply by using the give option on an item and just give it to the same party member and it'll go to the bottom. So it's not bad at all, but it just takes a couple minutes. Alright, Salsa, you got this. Very good, we'd love to see that. Hurry up, hurry up. You got it, Salsa. Okay, cool. <laughs> very, very nice. We're just gonna wait a second. Don't worry, it's making its way up. Okay, I didn't want to, I don't want to, you know, jinx myself, but I'm just, I, I feel good about this run. Look at that. I did it. I, I did it. I jinxed myself. <laughs> oh, come on. It, it keeps... <laughs> the Fierce Bar Trooper keeps just hitting right, af right as I'm healing and, and never when I'm actually mimicking. Okay, there we go. Let's get one more in. Okay, good. Well, something. Just heal and mimic. See, it sucks. I wish it would just do this when I'm mimicking, but it keeps doing it when I'm healing. This is its strongest move. Okay, come on. <sighs> Stop. Oh god, hurry up, hurry up. No! Oh gosh, that's... Oh my gosh, that was very... <laughs> that was... That, that was incredibly dangerous. Now, Berserk Rampage. Ugh, I wish I could have healed last turn so that I could profit from this, but I can't, so. Come on, do it again. Well... Whatever, his offense is still way up. Let's heal up there. Come on, don't do it again. Ah, oh, well, that's one of his lesser moves, actually, so that's good. Come on, at least we get to listen to this music longer. get one more. Good! Yes! We love to see that. <laughs> not, not poor Salsa getting beat up like the kid brother he is to so many enemies in these game, in this game, but because we like seeing Salsa retaliate and stand up for himself. We love a, we love a, a confident monkey. Okay, come on. Yes, okay, cool. Oh, uh, no, dang it. I thought that was the bum rush. Usually that's what the white flash is a tell for. Okay, never mind. I guess I'm wrong. Okay, back. Oh, goodness. Okay. Whew. Luckily, unlike Earthbound, you can actually just wait here on this so you know so you can know what's coming. While on Earthbound, when it showed. Damn. Whoa! I didn't even know I used mo- I, I thought I was healing for some reason, but I- It was because the last turn was that- Oh, that was awesome. Anyways, in Earthbound, it would have just automatically scrolled. It doesn't let you just hold on the enemy's text box stating their attack. And that brings up- Brings Salsa up to level 21. Nice. Oh no! Salsa- Salsa's encountering his old nemesis once again! This is a revenge story, everybody. This is a revenge story, ladies and gentlemen. All right, 
Finale of chapter five. This is gonna be intense. So, Salsa's inventory looks as such. Monkey want banana. Ooh, ah. Uh, uh. So I'm going with 10 super bombs. This is going to be crazy and exhilarating and I don't know what to expect of it. This is probably going to be one of the hardest, the hardest bosses in this entire run. So let's just hope uh, this can go well. It might take me a few tries, but oh well. Just gonna wait for everyone else to get knocked out. Come on. At least he's taking his time and going one by one, I guess. Come on. At least it didn't hit salsa, I guess. I, uh, I spoke too soon. Okay. There's two super bombs. Let's eat a luxury banana. Now these things only cure 20 more HP than they usually would than, uh, you know, any other, you know, hard-boiled, not hard-boiled, like, uh, spring egg, hot spring egg wood. But it does make a difference. Okay. And that was extremely good luck. It also allows us to get more monkey mimics in. Goodness, I wish I could have done that a little faster, but oh well. Goodness. Let's let's get that off first, and just let salsa heal up. Cool. Super bombs. I'm just trying to hopefully get it to to break its charging unit. If we can get that out of the way, then we're going to be in really good shape here. I guess I'll just throw another... Uh, well, that's not too bad. Let's go to Mimic now. Not bad. Get one more. We'll, uh, we'll use that. Oh gosh! I, I thought Salsa was going first, and I wasn't thinking. No! Oh man! It's all because I didn't realize. That sucks. I got so, oh, I got so far on that try. <sighs> All right, cool. No! Duh. Damn. Well, we've already lost. Try number three. This is dumb, this is stupid. No! No! Damn! Oh, I did it again! Oh! <sighs> and if not, we gotta hope Monkey Mimic can get us the rest of the way. Last super bomb. Ugh. Whew. This is exhilarating. Let's go. It's funny, these battles go by so much quicker than they usually would. Because I have to... Because I just have to wait. Oh gosh, what did I do that for? Oh man! I'm done. That sucks so much. Damn, I came so far, too. <sighs> I, I really needed to hit that there. And we're numb. Damn it. <sighs> Let's just 
just a loss. Lose confirm. Ugh. Lucas, please. Yes. Yes. Well, I guess it just hits everyone, probably. Damn. Nope. Don't want to do that. <laughs> not, not off to a great start. At all! Oh, gosh. Well, that just... That already cost me. I'm just... Take me out. Okay. I just had to check to figure out what was going on here. I don't know why I did that. That may have ended me, actually. Talk about simple mistakes. Damn! Wait for that to scroll up. Nope. Okay. I don't think about it after. Can't make that mistake. Okay. Thank you. 
<gasps> oh my gosh. <sighs> oh. And y'all thought the earthbound hard run was crazy. <gasps> that was a half hour. That wasn't too bad. <laughs> oh.